say hi you guys this is me miracle back with another video and yeah in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how i got this natural beat okay with affordable products sheen products and you know at your local beauty supply products okay i'm not as y'all see by my face i'm not no like mua or anything like that and i know you guys gonna have some doubts about my video but as y'all see this is the end result and you see i'm not all that type of you know like a whole face beat i'm just a simple natural uh, everyday look and this is something that i know you guys will love and like so if you do please give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment thank you let's get straight into the this video and no you guys let me tell you something i am not editing nothing out this video this is just going to be me this is how i am in a mirror every day you know so i'm gonna show you guys the real no edit no nothing this is just going to be a video so like i said you guys let's get straight into the video let's go Hey guys so yeah it's me miracle back with another video um today we're going to be doing a little makeup look my everyday makeup look with no foundation okay you guys no foundation and i don't knock people with that don't wear no foundation but i'm a type of no foundation type of girl because you know even if it's say even if you're protecting your skin with all that you still y'all i'm just not trying to have my face breaking out and stuff even though you know you got products to help your face and stuff i just don't want to go through that or nothing like that and plus i just don't know how to do it right now so i'm gonna be honest with you guys yeah i'm i'm really not knocking people that do a full face okay so you know you guys i just start off with my eyebrows i really it, i'm really simple with my eyebrows so I just kind of brush it like that. Oh yeah, and you can get this utensil from like um, your, your local beauty supply. I have a dark brown. It's just an eyebrow pencil, something simple, and they got the sharpener and you know, you can sharpen it. So I like working with easy things. Easy to use it like out the jar and stuff. I'm not that raw yet. I'm a beginner just like I'm trying to show other beginners how, you know, I'm really not that type of person to be doing too much and I don't spend a lot of time on my makeup. I'm not that type of girl and I don't like like eyeshadow. It's not that I don't like it. It's just like I'm still learning the process so I'm a more no nothing on my um eyelids at all so i start with my eyebrow with my eyebrow pencil as y'all see i just sharpened it um i just go in do a little do a little bit like that as y'all see, I need my eyebrows did. I usually do them myself, but for the video. You know, you wanna do it like real soft. Don't go in there too hard because like I said, you're a beginner, you don't really know, you know? And you don't wanna be looking crazy and stuff like that. So as y'all see, like it's kind of filling in more. Always use your stencil, you, your stencil. Damn, I don't even know how to talk, y'all. Always use your stencil. And I like, I like to go for like a dark eyebrow, but not too dark, but like where you can see it. I like really natural things. Like I don't like all that on my face or nothing like that. So for the girls, when I get done, you're going to see it. But for the girls, you see that? 
and you know your eyebrows never match just like your arms one is longer than the other one stuff like that your boobs one is bigger than the other one your eyebrows are never gonna match perfectly but if you get them to match perfectly girl then you got that okay you better than me point blank period okay so i just go in on this side And that's why I like using this pencil because if you mess up, all you gotta do is, and they come right off with the little stencil at the bottom. So I like that. So you guys see, you see how that will look? I just gotta go in a little more. They're perfect. So then I take my concealer from She Glam, any local, like, where I got this from was, like, I forgot where I got this from, but it could be your local Walmart, your local Walgreens, anything that sells concealer, and if you just go to any place, you just find your, your shade, but somebody helped me pick this out, and it's in Walnut, and I just use it for the bottom of my lashes i mean god damn why do i can't talk today why i can't talk today so i just use it for like i i do a dab like that i do a dab like that and i go in with this little pencil this little small pencil you know with the thing that looks just like this I don't know what to call it, y'all. I'm still beginning myself. Let me be honest, okay? I'm not a pro. And I know you in my MUAs out there is watching, gonna be watching me and be like, this do not know what she's doing. But look, it's a way everybody do their face, and I just don't do it like everybody else. You feel me? And it's simple. So then I take that, take this. And just match it with your eyebrow. As you guys see, it's already slightly perfect. You see that? Let me do this a little more. Y'all see that? Y'all can't tell me that ain't a cute eyebrow. A simple, real cute eyebrow. From the beginning, y'all thought that, mm mm, it ain't gonna look right. Baby, look. Let me tell y'all something. Like I said, do the same for like this eye over here. And if you mess up, just go up in there. Go in there with your pencil again. I like to slight rub it a little bit into my eye. And then, like I said, if you mess up, go back in with the pencil.
you know, get a dab it like that. And then I take my LA Pro Grill concealer that you can find at your local beauty supply store because this shit is bomb, no lie though, period. And I'm just saying like that. For the girls who know, no. For the girls who don't, don't. No, I'm just joking, y'all. But yeah, you use your LA Pro concealer. At the top. It's getting there, y'all. Okay, you guys, so after that, I use, like, this little sponge thing to, like, you can find this at your local uh, family dollar store. Everything is affordable and cheap here, you feel me? I'm not finna go spend a lot of money on some makeup that I wear not constantly, you feel me? This is, like, an everyday go-to makeup routine. It's not like I'm gonna do my makeup every day because I'm more of a natural girl, but when I do... This is what I do, you feel me? So we just gonna rub that in there. Well, lift it up, y'all. Make sure y'all lift it up. And then I kind of like rub that in there like that. Baby, tell me I ain't killing this shit right now. I usually be having a hard time with my eyebrows myself, y'all, but today is not one of those days for me, okay? Like I said, you just keep going up. And I just do that. So I like to bring this one a little up, I mean, more down more because as y'all see, this one is kind of higher than the other one. And I'll make sure I do that. Go up. And there you have it, girls. Some nice, pretty eyebrows. Not too much, right? I go in south with a little more detail right here. And then I brush it up. Eyebrows. Like I said, they not always going to match. And if they do, perfect. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> but today, I like them. They not too much. They not too bad. They just filled in and concealed at the bottom. So, yeah. Then I start with my, my like, concealer. Oh, yeah. I meant to tell you guys, too. Before I did all this, I definitely washed my face, did all my lotions and stuff. I put a hydrocortisone on my face before I do any makeup, anything, because hydrocortisone is, like, a working magic for all types of skins, and it help, like, get rid of anything that's 
impacting on your skin. So say for instance, like if you use the hydrocortisone and you're trying to do your makeup, make sure you put it at the bottom because then when you, if you don't and you use a different product, it probably will bump up. You feel what I'm saying? But with hydrocortisone, it gives it that extra boost of like vitamin. If you get what I'm saying, it gives you that extra boost of vitamin and it makes your skin look glossy. Because I usually have dry skin right here, but as y'all see, where's the dry skin? And I usually get it right here, but as y'all see, where is it at? I learned that hydrocortisone worked for my skin, so it might not work for all type of skins, but it definitely worked for mine. So I use that as a base, as a primer for me. So you guys, next then, I'm gonna start with my concealer. Like I said, in a walnut. And I put it right here. Right here. Right there. Not too much though, cause I hate that little ashy look that makeup brings. And right here, down my nose. And right here, on my chin. And right here, my other eye. So girls, after I do that, I kind of like to take this little sponge thing that I got. I have hella of these at your local beauty, I mean, Family Dollar. And I use this instead of a, like, um, what's it called? Like one of those big uh, circles. I don't really use those because I don't like how it don't really get under there. Like on my bags, I really want to cover those. And I feel like this is perfect to cover those. I have new ones, but you know, so I take that and just you want to get in there. Just conceal it in there, y'all. And y'all see, y'all already can tell the difference, but keep patting it, y'all. Keep patting it to make it like blend more into your skin. You don't want the shape line. You want it to be as natural as possible. So you don't want the lines to look like it's just sitting there, you feel me? So just that. See that? Just that. See that? And then I forgot, I put a little concealer right here. above my lip just a little bit just a little bit yo guys so then i'll take the other one right here you just want to dab it down get get it fully into your skin I need a little more right here because as y'all see my bag is still showing and this is not you feel me see that so that's when you know you need a little more oh yeah just like that baby get it in there 
Yeah, yeah, get in there. Yeah, yeah, hey, big girl. Come bag it up. Won't you bag it up? Okay. See that? Dab it, ladies. You can't even tell, really. It's there. Honestly. I'm gonna put a little bit more concealer right here. I won't full coverage on my chin. So I'm just dab it. Dab it, you guys. Dab it. Look at my chin. And you know, I want my, I love, I like makeup or whatever, but I want to still see me. The beauty that's within me. Like if I, I feel like if I put on tons of makeup and things like that, I, I'm just not going to be myself. And no like hate to the girls that do that. It's just me. It, it, I just like to look like me still. I don't want to like take off my makeup and be like, damn, I look like a different person. I want to say, damn, I look like me still. I look beautiful still, so I don't really need it. You feel me? That's how I want to feel. So, y'all, every day I do not do this. This is not a go-to for me, but, like, it's an everyday look when I do want to put on the makeup and pop out, you know. And you define your upper lip, so when you do put on your lip liner, Boom. You feel me? You want to like drag that onto your eyebrow like that. Like that. Like that. You see that, y'all? Like, it looks like I'm still me, but with a little bit of oomph mm, and you probably don't know what move I got on. So then, I take my powder from She Glam as well. I remember where I got this from. I got these products from Shein, you guys. I did a, I did a first time video, and I wanted to do try out the Shein products that they had on there, and I really do love like they stuff like. I really do. You see that? They concealer and stuff. Look at that. And it's affordable and cheap. It's not pricey. So then I take this little sponge with my powder. Setting powder is in a light brown. But it looks like... I don't know if that's light brown, but y'all. I just dab it. Blow it a little bit. You see it right there? Just not too much. Right there, use it, use that. For your forehead right there. Not too much. And then, take a little bit. Right there, not too much. Y'all see that? It's coming in there. This video might be fast, y'all, but it's supposed to be fast. It's supposed to be for an easy makeup tutorial. And then you dab it right here. Right. Watch out, right. Take this right here. Everything that, and then I take a little bit, y'all, just for the fun of it. Like, and then wipe it down like that. Wipe it down like that, y'all.
Okay, you guys. After I'm done with that, I'll let that sit for a minute. Shit. After I'm done with that, y'all, I let that sit for a minute and then I take my The Warriors by Juva. And you know the darkest color to contour your face. So I just dab a little bit. You just want to dab a little bit to bring like the color back to your face. I just and yes, I use eyeshadow. No contour palette, no none of that. Easier with eyeshadow. And I just Y'all see it? The little dark? Okay. So when I brush it, it's just not. It's not gonna look. Okay. Then I take this brush, do this, and blend my contour in. Make sure. You're getting that contour, I mean, that eyeshadow. This is the easiest way I do it. You feel me? Look at that color, bring it back to my skin. And you wanna just let it be known that it's right there, but not too much. You feel me? See that? Let it be known it's right there, but not too much. You feel me? You feel me? So after that, I let my powder sit. I take my bigger brush and I just wipe it all off. And the way that you put it on there, like I said, if you gotta use your hands then you use them but i kind of i love using my hand look at this beat okay so then i take my press refresh setting spray before I do my lips and lashes. And I spray about four times all over the face. And this is from Shane too, so yeah, go 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 get the hookup. When that dry, it's gonna look fly, y'all. Hold on, let me spray this side a little more. Okay. When that dry, you guys, it's gonna look fine. So then, I take the brow pencil that I use for my eyebrows, and I use it for my lips as well. And I just outline, you know, to give it that extra color boom to your face
against you. I like to get it. A dramatic looking look. Then I take my little plain clear lip gloss you can get at the beauty supply. Give back. And then I take a little bit of pink max at your local beauty supply too. It's in a nudes, and I just dab it a little bit in the middle of the top and bottom lip. And look at that. Baby, tell me this not a look, baby. Wait till I put that lash lashes on. Because don't play with me. Because don't play with me. Why are you playing with me? Don't play with me. My face be, baby. An easy, breezy, beautiful cover girl face be. For affordable, easy products. So you guys, then I take my eyelashes. As y'all see, I already have like individuals on there, but that's why, baby, we gonna cover that up, okay? I already measured my eyelashes and I'm gonna be using hair glue because I like to take my eyelashes off. And y'all see, I was pulling at this and I like to take my eyelashes off like the same day because like they irritate my eyes when I go to sleep or I don't want it like on me. So like, you guys will take the hair glue and you can find this at your local beauty supply. <laughs> like, and everything here that I'm saying is really affordable. Like, if you only got $5, y'all, this is some stuff that you can get. Like, you know, just to look and feel pretty when you wake up you just start your day do your little fresh makeup beat if you're going somewhere and if you're not you just feel like you want to <laughs> baby yeah this this is how this is what that's i mean that is exactly how i thought <laughs> like for real Patience is key when you're trying to put on these eyelashes, y'all. So, y'all look. Damn. I just fucked myself in the eye, but wait till I put on this other eyelash. Baby. Hold on, y'all. I don't know if this stuff. <laughs> this was. <laughs> y'all, that's why it was looking so weird. I was one. I was wondering. Like, why the fuck is it, uh. Looking big on one side. We gonna do that over. And yes, y'all, I'm not editing this, so it's gonna be in there. I'm showing you that, guys that everybody do mess up, but just take it has it's patience, y'all. And when you do this, it's gonna be so much easier because literally y'all, I had a hard time with my makeup as well. So this was the easiest way I could learn myself.
So like I said, it's patience when you put on these. If you already not like a G putting these on, use your tweezers, but like I'm kind of like, already like in there like swimwear tell me that's not cute y'all Take your time with these lashes. Take all the time you need, but you wanna. So y'all, tell me, tell me I didn't do a good job. Oh shit. And you guys, I do have two modes right here and sometimes I just get a little, and I just want to make them show a little darker. I got two big marks right there. so. I kind of like to like show them sometimes to give you that. Mm. So yeah, you guys, if you like this video and like how my makeup came out, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, you guys. I really appreciate Real Talk. And if you guys want to see some more, more, more videos like this, please just let me know in the comment section because for real, you guys, just show your girl some support for real but yeah see you guys in my next video deuces